Hi, so family. This is Melanie, the Spirit Doula. I've been on vacation put for the past um, four or five days now. Um, it's the annual trip that my family and I do, and um, we travel out to the shore in Maryland, and we have a lot of fun. It was amazing. It was a nice break. Um, I've been going a lot for the past month. Um, and for the past couple of months, so much has happened in my life, like so many activations, so many leveling up, just so much. And I have received so much information, excuse the noise, that's my nephew's outside playing. <laughs> but I've received so much information these past few days. Um, I've been extremely tired, like my sleep, a couple of hours at a time, I wake up, I'm receiving information, trying to record it, write it down, just really understand what's happening. And in all of that, I am just so elated. I feel so much joy. Now, have there been moments where there have been stress or times where I just, you know, wanted to go inside of a closet and hide? Of course. But I'm able to deal with that now, especially as an empath, because my habit was um, hiding. My friend would say, you know, I'm a Leo. That's my um, sun sign. And my friend would say, you're the Leo in the cave. You're the only Leo that I know that doesn't act like a Leo. Like you're always behind closed doors, always, you know, behind the scenes. And I I actually like that. That's, you know, something about me that was my protection from all the energies that I was constantly receiving. So um, with that said, um, yeah, I'm able to transmute these energies so much easier now. And it has been a process, guys. <laughs> I don't mean like a, a several week process or several month process or a journey of healing process. I mean like um, almost 10 years of, of a process. Um, and anyway, my goal here is to help you guys through that process. So um, I received some messages almost on a daily basis. I receive, I actually post my daily messages. They're about one minute long. They always happen to be about one minute long that I receive from Spirit. I post them on my Instagram page. I may add it to the beginning of these videos as well, but here is where I elaborate on it more. Um, none of this is prescripted. I'm literally speaking to you as Spirit speaks through me. So the first message that I received was on happiness. And so um, basically what I received from Spirit that happiness is like the pathway to true enlightenment and if we can stay in a steady place of happiness then we are in a place of peace and if we can stay in that place of peace that everything just kind of falls into place and we'll, we'll be in true enlightenment however like how possible is that for you to be in that place i'm a mother of three daughters i have several nephews um I do so much in my life that sometimes um, chaos just happens, you know? I'm also a melanated being, so chaotic being. So these things um, just happen to disturb that peace. The goal is to try to get back to that place as often as possible. Ultimately, the receivement said that if we can daily be in a place of peace, at least daily, at least take a moment, a minute, several minutes, if you can, an hour, to be in a happiness place that therefore causes peace, then we are on the correct path. We're, we're moving along the correct path. So how can we do that? Number one, you should your goal should be to meditate every single day. And I'm actually going to do a video on how to meditate because so many people don't know it, what it is to meditate. It is not sitting like in this position with your hands like this saying, um, no. Maybe that works for some people. It has never worked for me. I don't know anyone that it has worked for, but um, we're all individuals. And so meditation is something um, different for each and every one of us. With that said, um, it is important daily. You should be trying to meditate daily. You should be trying to sit still. You don't have to have an altar. You don't have to have a place of meditation, a yoga mat, any of that. Um, just find a place of quiet if it is in your bathroom in your bathtub or in your toilet like let me tell you again i have three children and sometimes the bathroom is the only place where i can get solace not all the times because even they like bust into the bathroom when i'm there right all of you who have children know what i'm talking about so 
even if it's brushing my teeth and I'm rushing and I have things to do, I still try to take a moment to connect, okay? Um, it is important that we, as a receiver said, that we try to have some semblance of happiness every day. Not even a semblance, actual happiness. And so how do we have that? How do we attain that when life is so chaotic and stressful around us? Well, think of the times when you were the happiest, right? And my happiest times were when I was like a child or um, even playing with my children. Like you just naturally detach from worldly things and um, you're happy, you know? Um, running around with my daughters or laughing with them or I don't know, they'll look at Instagram posts that are hilarious and they'll share it with me and I'm laughing with them. And in that moment, I forget everything else. And in that moment, I am happy. And the reality is in that moment, I'm in peace. And peace is the pathway to enlightenment, right? There are many pathways, but this is the easiest avenue just by being in happiness. Like, when I received that receivement, I was like, duh, that makes so much sense. Because I'm not thinking about anything else, you know? Um, when you're eating some really delicious food and you know you're dancing because it's so good, you're in happiness, you're in peace, right? You feel good in that moment. You are so close. So if we can be in that happiness place on a daily basis, like that is the goal, you know? That is my goal, it needs to be your goal. Whatever you can do, if you have to look back at pictures, sometimes I look at my daughter's pictures when they were babies and you know, um, it makes me smile. I'm in a happy place. That means I'm in peace. That means I'm on my path to my soul mission, enlightenment, the path that I want to go be on spiritually. So again, if you can get to that place, not if you can, that is the goal. That is a mission for the day, you know, try to get to that place on a daily basis and, um, you will see how good you feel, how at peace you feel. And, um, yeah. Again, the goal is happiness, and let's do this together, all right? See you soon. Love you all. Bye-bye.